Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. All right, so this is gonna be a quick pick message. Um, yeah, and we're just gonna get straight into it. So this is messages for, blah, blah, blah. This is messages from your spirit guides for this week. Uh, if you all, if there's a lot of wind in the background, hey, I'm in the elements today. Um, however though, messages from your spirit guides for this week so you have three options to choose from before i get into which option is which i'd like to thank all of you who are subs to the channel thus far thank you so very much uh like comment share subscribe i drop videos weekly also if you'd like to book a private reading coaching consultation session saying every walk and read uh what are the other readings patreon if you want to become a patreon check the pin comment below as well as the description box below all right three options to choose from. choose from option number one option number two option number three Pause the video, see which of the messages uh, you feel resonate with you the most or which of the selections, and then come back when you're ready. All right, so option number one, messages from your spirit guide. What should you focus on this week? Okay, so we have the five of cups that came out in the reverse. We have the seven of pentacles that came out. You all cannot see that in the reverse. And we have the two of swords that came out in the upright. All right, so the message that I'm getting for you all, option number one is, you know, it's time for you to make a decision. I feel like you have to make a decision on something that you don't necessarily want to. You're being told to, you know, take back your energy, you know, uninvest. And I don't think that's a word, but, you know, take back your energy from something. I do feel like it's not something that you want to do. This could be, you know, maybe letting go of a connection that you don't really want to let go of, but it's for your well-being. Uh, that's what I'm saying with this two of swords, you know, you're being urged to make an important decision for your well-being uh, Let's see. Let's grab one more card in regards to advice. Give me advice for option number one in regards to what's going on with them Ah, page of swords in the upright look on the bright side for some of you this is a career message you're being told to you know start looking for new jobs for some of you where you are currently it's just it's not investing in you you're investing too much time is you know it, it's not panning out in the way that you want to so start looking you know looking on the bright side of things you know start planning for the future and getting ready for the future definitely with this page of swords you know you're not being told to rush into anything yet but start considering the future you know so make that big decision that you have to make this week and letting go of a connection that's not serving you it's definitely either a job or a romantic something or another oh no i can't even say romantic it's either a job or a connection with a person make that decision let it go and start you know looking towards the future towards the solutions that you need all right so option number one you all let me know how you felt about felt about that in the comment section below give this video a like comment share and subscribe and let's get on to option number two so messages from your spirit guides for this week here fine in the reverse all right somebody just straight up you all there's somebody that's been lying to you <laughs> i feel like spirit chose violence this morning there's someone that's been lying to you um someone that you're close to someone that you've been going to you know someone that you've been trusting for you know advice and honesty uh this person could be older than you i also feel like for some of you you're being urged to be honest with yourselves you know for some of you this could involve a tourist you might need to have a conversation with a tourist who's been kind of you know being a little who's been falsifying their words to you uh ooh, another message about you know doing something in the now so we have the three of wands that came out in the reverse all right so the major message that i'm getting though somebody that you really trust and are close to has been very passive aggressive with you they've been omitting the truth to you about something this person could be a tourist they could be an air sign most notably um maybe an aquarius or a libra that's coming through um also someone could be traveling towards you someone from a distance could be traveling towards you very soon uh somebody who wants to reveal the truth to you someone from a past romantic connection either traveling towards you or you're going to be getting a message from this person soon let's see universe give me more insight give me advice or whatever it is that you need for option number two i wanted to say option number three option number two to know let's see this one ah it's an old friend soulmate connection so for some of you there's an old friend that's you know that, that has been very passive aggressive withholding information from you someone that you've trusted very much for others of you you have an old friend that's coming towards you to make amends with you you know this is somebody that doesn't want to 
this is somebody that they don't want to get rid of you. They may be from a past life connection. You know, they've been following you on your soul journey. You've been following each other and they're not going to let go of you now. So that's what I see for you. Option number two. So you all let me know how you feel about that in the comment section below. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Book a private reading coaching consultation session with me. And let's move on to our very last option number three. So option number three, let's see. What's the message that your spirit guides have for you this beautiful morning? We have the um, Ten of Wands that came out in the upright. First thing I heard was that Teddy Pendergrass song. Um, I think I need to let her go. Do, 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 do. Love TKO. There we go. Ten of Pentacles. Ooh, this is all about completion. Ten of Pentacles in the upright. Ten of Wands in the upright. And Seven of Wands that came out in the upright. This is about, okay. You're not being urged to let anyone go. You're not being, I'm not feeling anything negative or sinister about this, but you are being told to guard your energy. Maybe most notably from family. It's time for you to move on from a situation. For some of you, I feel like there's been a family matter where maybe you were the peacemaker. You were the one that was in the middle. It's time for you to, you know, stop trying to be that peacemaker i feel like it's been more stressful to you than the people that it's in directly involved with i feel like you've taken on a problem that's not yours and your spirit guides are saying you know it's time for you to fight that off you know let let people solve their own issues you know you got to preserve your energy you know rise above this with the energy of the seven you know rise above this you know because it's, it's really it's i feel like this is something that's really been causing you a lot of stress for some of you, it's not easy to just, you know, detach from this situation or fight this thing off or there's something you have been fighting off in regards to family matters. It's not easy because, you know, it's family. Y'all can live in the same household, but you're being urged to, you know, you got to let, you got to rise above. You got to let this thing go. So let's see. Universe, give me further, further advice for option number three. Boom. Maybe if this is something that, you know, that requires cards are blowing around maybe this is something that that requires you know a, a mediator of some sort you know the matriarch of the family for some of you i'm hearing you know go to your grandmother or go to you know your mother uh this could be a fight amongst siblings you know or go to someone else maybe this is a counselor of some sort for some of you this is couples counseling you know you've been fighting uh i don't want to say a losing war yeah it has been a losing war because you've been stressed out it's time for you to get unstressed let bygones be bygones and, you know, find a, 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 a solution that works or and that may be removing yourself from other people's quarrels. And if this is a quarrel that involves you, you know, getting a counselor or a therapist or someone that can be in the middle that's going to be unbiased to help you all sort through it. That's what I'm getting. All right. Option number three. I thank you all so much for tuning in. Like, comment, share, subscribe if you feel compelled to. Um, book a private reading, coaching, consultation session with me. Same day read, walk and read. Become a Patreon. Thank you to my Patreons. All right, you guys. I love you. Peace and blessings. Goodbye. And good morning. <laughs>